Pokemon Pocket is alive and today we are going to be looking at the battle pass uh, we can look at the missions the perks what we're getting and is it worth is it worth it so let's get straight into it uh, if we open up the news click on the first one so the battle pass is eight pounds in the UK well just under eight pounds eight pounds for 30 days that's not bad at all so it's I'd say it's pretty pretty uh well priced the first benefit is that we get an additional pack every 24 hours. So that means we're getting an extra 30 packs a month. That is going to massively bump up our accounts really quick, getting all those extra cards. So yeah, that's that's pretty solid. Promo cards. So straight off the bat, they're busting out this amazing Pikachu card. It's a real stunner. I mean, the color, the line work is just beautiful beautiful so yeah stunning card up for grabs and this is going to change every so often so they will bring out more of these you know cards that you can only really get if you are buying the battle pass and there's a sneaky little thing that we can do at the moment where you can subscribe for free for the first two weeks make sure you do cancel though so you need to cancel 24 hours before uh, the end of the cost like the trial so it doesn't cost you anything the only thing with this though is it means if there's any future battle passes you're gonna have to pay or you're gonna miss out so it is difficult it's a difficult decision to make do you risk it for a biscuit um i mean you could see if there's other you know other pokemon that come out that you prefer but that pikachu card for me is just gold pure gold so uh, we're coming to the shop limited time and events and yeah, you can see straight off the bat, we picked up Pikachu. Um, and this Mewtwo artwork is so sick. They've just literally killed it. And I did pick up the backdrop, which was a bit of a mistake. I thought it was the playmat. The playmat is what you should prioritize. It is so sick. And you'll get the most value out of this because every fight you have, you will see the playmat for the majority of the fight. Um, the next would be for me would have to be the card sleeve. The, I mean, this Mewtwo artwork is just on another level. It's a no-brainer for me. Yeah, those would be what I aim to get. And if we come and have a look at the missions, uh, got to go to premium. And it's pretty pretty straightforward. So just need to collect some um, grass-type Pokemon. That's easy. You get that from the Mewtwo, uh, Mewtwo? Mewtwo pack. Um, Fire, we get from Charizard. Um, Water, I'm not sure. Lightning, obviously Pikachu, but if you're not sure, just click on the pack and it will show you which Pokemons you can get at the top. But what you want to do is we're going to open up, say, a Mewtwo pack for a week till we hit all 11 cards. Then we can change to Charizard and then we can change to Pikachu. And that way we should hit all the types that we need. Then if we go down, so collecting cards, easy. Um, and we're not just getting hourglasses for the packs. We're also getting the, the wonder picks as well. And these can be really useful. Um, I picked up a Moltres today. I needed that EX, so solid. So yeah, the wonder picks are pretty sick as well. And then, yeah, just three wonder picks. That's easy. You can do that in probably like two days. No brainer. Uh, I mean, no problem. And five again, do that in under five days. So yeah, really, really easy. Opening up booster packs. So six booster packs, that'll be two days if we're doing the battle pass. Uh, so two days, three days, and then four days. So four days to do 10. So pretty easy. And yeah, just you're getting a lot of bang for your buck. So, I mean, for me, I feel like you just have to get it. You're getting like the Mewtwo stuff that looks sick. You're getting the Pikachu card that's limited edition and we're getting all these other bonuses as well. I just feel like it's a must and for £8 a month, you can't really complain. Um, but yeah, I'm really looking forward to seeing what other stuff's coming out. And of course, we've only really got sort of Gen 1 at the moment, but they're definitely going to bring out more packs. I'm hoping they have like a more competitive scene coming out soon. Uh, but yeah, I'm loving it. So you guys let me know in the comments below what you think. Um, thanks so much for watching. Please leave me a cheeky thumbs up. Make sure you smash, smash, smash 
that subscribe and I'll see you all in a video soon. Peace.